to turn to the country's uh, new leadership, talking about Donald Trump and the president-elect's decisions about who he's going to pick for his cabinet. So possible Secretary of State pick, one name being considered is former CIA Director General David Petraeus. He spoke after his meeting with the president-elect yesterday, so listen to this. The meeting went very well. I uh, was with him for about an hour. Uh, he basically walked us around the world, uh, showed a great grasp of a variety of the challenges that are out there. and some of the opportunities as well. So very good conversation and Did we'll see where it goes from here. How well do you know General Petraeus and what would you what do you think of him as I, potential I, Secretary I don't of know State? him personally. I have worked for him through different I worked uh, I, I was at a, a command underneath uh, General Stan McChrystal, who worked for General Petraeus during uh, an insurgency. Well, during, we, it was a surge, but we call it the awakening when we were fighting uh, al-Qaeda in western uh, Iraq. He was, he was really, really good about thinking outside the box. What we were doing was not working, so we need to see what the enemy's doing and respond to them. And the way we respond to them is the way you defeat an enemy. We killed them. We killed a lot of them. And then they turned. We actually ended up winning the war until we ended up losing the war. But being a four-star general, being the head of the CIA, having a Ph.D. in foreign relations from Princeton, he's definitely qualified to do it. It's just a matter of what um, the Trump administration wants. Uh, he will be more active in the Middle East than maybe some other picks and potentially get into the nation-building type stuff, which gets us into some problems. Um, but he's a smart guy. Um, you know, he's made mistakes in the past. He's learned from his mistakes, and everybody makes mistakes. So uh, I like him. Real quick, Tony, do you think it'd be a problem with the misdemeanor that he pleaded guilty to related to cla um, mishandling classified material? I'm talking about general. Petraeus. No, no. Is that going to be a problem with the confirmation? No, if anything, I think it's kind of vindication for, uh, to General Petraeus, who was skewered in a way that probably was undeserving uh, when Hillary Clinton was viewed as getting away with a lot worse as far as the uh, giving classified material uh, opportunity to be breached. So in that regard, I think the other piece, it, it's, it's a plus. The other piece I think is important is the failure in Iraq was a diplomatic failure as much as it was a military failure. And that's what the point Donald Trump made during the campaign. Right. Right. is by not renegotiating the SOFA, by not ma maintaining Maliki and managing Maliki mm -hmm. properly, we lost the war. It was a, it was a political decision based on uh, uh, political promises during campaigns. Right. Rob, um, tell us about your foundation, your gratefulnation.org, please. Uh, one, uh, we started a foundation. I'm a special operator. I just turned 40. And uh, the guys at my age are... are well, you the, look at the, Thank you so much. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, guys at my age are starting to retire right now, and they're wondering what, what, they, what they can do. So I've actually started a foundation called Your Grateful Nation. Org that takes special operators that puts them into a, a high level jobs with different companies. All we need is uh, some mentors from different companies, and then we give them special operators. It's working out really well. We're putting, putting people to work every, uh, every week, so it's pretty exciting. A veteran has never let me down when I've been uh, We've got a 100% uh, success ratio so far with your great yes, nation. And thank, thank you, you for your service. You're very welcome. But everybody who's serving today and who has sacrificed for our freedom, thank I will, you. I will tell them personally. Appreciate I'm, saying that. It was good to see you, Thanks, Rob. Good to see you, too. Thanks, thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you.